Hey ladies, so I have another haul for you guys, and I know, kind of haul in today, but it was New Year's, so we got New Year's money, and time to spend it. So the first place I went to is Cotton On, and there's a website there. It's an Australian company, and it's new to my mall, so I've never been in there, but they had lots of sale signs, so I was like, hmm, let's check this place out. They had a lot of cute stuff. Um, they have a lot of like basic white tees, V-necks, stuff like that. Um, but I I don't really like basics and stuff like that. So I got whatever caught my eye. The first thing I got are these pumps, and um, they're like a nude blush color. And I've been wanting shoes like this for the longest time. So it says um ruby blush patent and it's an australian so it um, has australian sizes and it's a 39 or eight to eight and a half and i am in love with these shoes i tried them on they're really comfortable the high isn't that high and there's a plat a hidden platform in there so i really like that and i've just been wanting a nude heel for the longest time um a lot of people have requested like my shoe heel collection so I will be doing that in the future, so watch out for that. I'm still figuring out a way how I'm going to film that and stuff. Okay. The next thing I got was this coat, jacket, whatever you want to call it. And it looks like this. So it has a cuff. And then it has these like button detailings down the side. And then more button detailings right there. I've been wanting a jacket like this for a really long time. And then it has the buttons right back here. And the buttons in the back. And it fits me really, really nicely. And it was only $30. So I think that was a really good price. Especially since like Forever 21 is around that price. And the material that they use is probably not real wool. And they don't keep you warm at all and this is really like thick and keeps you so warm so i think this is like an awesome deal yeah so this is like really nice and the store is called um, cotton on as in o n they do have a website so i'll post that up on the sidebar as well and then i just got um some scarves and they were hanging up by the registers and I couldn't resist. So this one's like a white um, metallic one. I don't know if you can see the metallic lines on there. And then I got another black one. And I actually had to go in here twice because my aunt had taken one of my scarves. Because she really liked it. And she's pregnant so I was like, oh, okay, I'll just give that to her. And then um, this is my favorite one. It's like a leopard print and it's white and blue and I like that like the leopard print isn't obnoxious and you can wear this with like basically any like neutral color to like um, spice up an outfit so I thought that was really cool and then my splurge of the day which I didn't buy myself my mom bought it for me it was my New Year's present I finally got some new True Religions, and they're the um, dark wash ones. What are these? Disco Billy Big T, and they have the pink Swarovski crystals. If you can see that right there, and all in the front, like that. I think they are so adorable. And then their boot cut at the bottom. So I'm really excited excited about that. I got a really good deal on them, so I'm really happy. Um, I haven't gotten new jeans in the longest time and I've been dying to since one of my true religions has a hole in the back pocket that I need to get repaired. And then my other true religion, I lost the, like, this button to it. This button to it, so I can't button my pants. And, like, I don't know why, but that always happens to me. Like, on my jeans, like, they don't rip or anything. I just lose the button. I think it is so weird. Alright, so, um, that's up, that's pretty much it for, like, the clothing and stuff, and then I got 
this. I went to TJ Maxx and I got this movie. My mom and my brother um, went shopping there because my mom had to give my brother a New Year's present and he just wanted like a lot of new clothes. So they went to TJ Maxx and stuff and I went with them. And I haven't gone to like TJ Maxx or Ross or Marshalls in the longest time. But um, since when do they sell Gucci bags and Fendi bags at TJ Maxx? Okay, so I walk into TJ Maxx, and they have this, like, big little corner in the entrance, and it's, like, designer corner, and they have, like, designer jeans and stuff, and I kind of expected that, you know, like, Joe and Seven for All Mankind, and I'm walking around, and they have, like, this table in the middle, and I look over, and I think it's someone's bag, like, they just put it down to lay over, but it had a price tag on it, and it was a Gucci bag, and I pick it up, and I look at it, and... It has a TJ Maxx price tag on it, and it says um, $1,200, and I was like, what? Are they selling this here? So I keep looking around that table, and I find three more Gucci bags, and they're, they're like, pretty, they're okay Gucci bags. Bags I probably wouldn't purchase if I was in a store and I had other selections, but they were decent, and I'm just looking around, and then I find a Fendi bag and a YSL bag, and I was like, what is going on here? So that kind of changed my little idea about Gucci and stuff. Just seeing them at like a, a designer, like a sellout store, do you know what I mean? Like an overstock store. So I don't know how I feel about that. But yeah, I got Sex in the City, the movie, because it's like one of my favorite movies. I already do have the movie, but I don't have the case to it for some reason. I just have the DVD. So, oops, I haven't even opened the top. So yeah, I just have the DVD, but I wanted the case because I'm starting a DVD collection and yeah, my DVD collection only has seven DVDs in it so far, but I'm trying to add more. And now I'm ranting because I'm a psychopath and crazy, but yeah, Sex in the City. Can't wait for number two. Have you seen the trailer? I will link it somewhere up here. Okay, wow. I'm going really crazy right now. I should go. Alright, I hope you guys are having a great new year. It's probably going to be like January 10 or something when I post this up. But thanks you guys for watching. Bye!